Hello ladies and gentlemen welcome to Triple N Media I am Nick Nickam in this presentation we're going to look at how we can free up from hard drive space and speed up Lightroom Classic on a PC and when you bring up your Lightroom you're going to see a checkerboard here with all these pictures and if you look at the catalog it shows all pictures 4505 pictures I have and if you imagine each picture is uh, like 15 megabytes for a 24 megapixel uh, image that's like almost six gigabytes or more and if you have 10 times that one you can imagine how much uh, space is taken up and these are all previews of your original pictures let me clarify that these are just previews of your original pictures it is not going to do anything to your previous picture except you know it is a preview so in order to get rid of this if you get rid of these previews then when you bring up that folder again it will create another set of previews so when you don't need it you don't need to keep that in memory and slow down the Lightroom so what we're going to do is once this is highlighted we go to selected all these uh, 4505 images by pressing uh, control A we are going to go to the library and then we're going to press on preview and in the preview you see discord one to one preview previews so basically these are like duplicate images stored by the Lightroom while you're processing your original images we can discard this you don't you're not losing your original images when you reload the folder from your original image folder the Lightroom will recreate these images so you don't have to worry about it the ones which you had done like six months ago or a year ago you don't really need it so when you do that discard now here you can see this little bar showing it is uh, taking care of this uh, process and when it's complete uh, it would have deleted all those 4500 plus previews it will reduce your disk space it will speed up the process of the Lightroom and hopefully this would be helping you to optimize your Lightroom performance thank you so much for watching this presentation and please please do subscribe to our YouTube channel we have several videos on how to use Lightroom for editing everyday pictures and also optimizing Lightroom performance. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.